Well, hello and welcome to our talk about design and specifically designing to achieve buoyancy. So in our middle school class here, one of the classes, we use design to achieve a purpose. We want to see how we can hold as many pennies in a 3D printed object as we possibly can. So we design an object, or rather the students design an object, to be able to hold as many pennies as they possibly can. So we've done this in the past, there's been many videos, but we really haven't discussed what we're doing with our 3D printed designs. So all these are student designed penny boats. They are meant to hold pennies on top of water. We want to make our object as buoyant as possible. And buoyancy is the ability to resist sinking, the ability to displace water. So that's what we're doing. We are creating structures that would displace water and have less mass than the water we are displacing. So we will go ahead and we will test these out. Okay, here we go, penny boats. Go ahead and place one at a time in there. It holds one. Keep on going. Two. Four, five, six, it held six. Oh, it held six. Six. All right, there we go. Let's see how many it'll hold. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, it held seven. It sunk. There we go. Let's see how many it holds. It held 12. Good job. All right, here we go. The next one. One. Oopsies. Two. Well, it held two, but then it kind of tipped. All right. It came back. Let's see if it holds two again. One. Oh, it's going to be tippy. One, two, three. Oh, it held three, but then it kind of got tippy. Yeah. Let's see if we can do that again. Maybe try to place them right in the middle. One. Oh dear, it's kind of waterlogged. Two. Three, uh, it holds two fine, but it won't hold three. Okay, this one didn't get totally printed. It had some issues. So we're gonna try it anyway. We're gonna see what it does. Go ahead. One. Oh, it won't hold them. It's a little tippy. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna print this one again and get it fully printed and then we'll test it. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five
14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Oh, I think it held 18 successfully. Good job. All right, here we go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Oh, it helped sixteen. Good job. Good job. <laughs> well done. Hey folks, thanks for watching. Thanks for the view. If you're still watching at this point in the video, give yourself a Rona 5. You don't know what a Rona 5 is? Well, the Rona 5 is... It's a self high five. That's right. So hey, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to work hard because, yeah, hard work is its own reward. Thanks for watching.